I'm going to show two methods of creating a curved vault shape following this example with a width of 5 meters, height of 2.5 meters, and a diameter of 5 meters. On the floor plan, select the shell tool and choose the revolved method. For the first example, we use the simple construction method. Click the center point for the shell and give a radius to include the overall width of the vault and set the revolution to 90 degrees as per the example. We can see the result in the 3D window and the red shape behind shows what we want to end up with. To achieve this shape, the shell's profile needs to be adjusted. Select the top node and select Move node in the pet palette. Drag the height of the node to the shell's base and enter the offset for the X direction by the vault's radius. Now select the top edge of the profile, select Curve Edge in the pet palette and enter the vault's height value. This now shows the finished curved vault. For the second example, we need to draw the shape of the profile to be extruded on the floor plan. Draw an arc using the vault's width of 5 meters and height of 2.5 meters. I'll just drag this out of the way of the existing shell. Select the shell tool again and this time choose the detailed construction method. Hold down the spacebar to activate the magic wand and click on the profile. Next we need to draw the revolution axis of the shell. This needs to be offset from the profile's endpoint by the vault's curve radius. Hover over the endpoint and enter an offset in the X direction. Draw the axis and complete the shell by entering the revolution angle. Finally, the shell needs to be rotated to the correct plane. Select the shell in 3D, click a node on the profile and choose free rotate from the pet palette. Draw the rotation axis and click two points to rotate the shell around. And this completes the vault, giving the same result as using the first method.